Welcome to another edition of The Ring Generals. I am Eric, and we are going to be doing a stream of UFC, well, EA's UFC 3, and we're going to be doing Derek Lewis versus Junior Dos Santos, which is going to happen this Saturday. UFC Fight Night only on ESPN Plus. Kind of a cheap plug for you right there. So, as we all know, Derek Lewis has been on a roll as of late. Junior Dos Santos, uh, you know, great fighter. And as I haven't seen him fought since uh, last year, so we're going to be doing a simulation of Derek Lewis of Jr and Junior Dos Santos in this one. So, let's get to it. I don't know which uh, gear he's going to be. Well, let's see. He usually puts on... Uh... It's usually black that he always wears. Dos Santos, um, probably he would have to go with the white or a gray one. All right, so which is the um, place that they're actually gonna fight? I think they're gonna be fighting in. I know they're gonna be fighting in Kansas, Wichita, Kansas. So it must be in the interest back or interest back arena. Scott, no, it's not the one. Um. I can't even find it. Where's the interest arena? The hell? I can't find it. Okay. So, I'm guessing it's not here. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, well. You know what? We're just gonna do go with whatever they give us. Let's just say that it's in the uh, Toyota Center. You know. I don't think it matters which arena it is, just as long as we get to see the damn fight. <laughs> that's all we that's all we care about, man. Hopefully you enjoy that last stream that I did. It was W2K19 for Fastlane, getting you ready for Fastlane. Up next, it's a heavyweight collision between the Black Beast, Derek Lewis, and Junior Dos Santos. Oh yeah. I promise you, you don't want to mistake his kindness for weakness. Affable guy, but his UFC tenure is really the stuff of legend. Started UFC career at 9-0 right out of the chute. I think many of you probably remember the UFC <coughs> debut and knockout of Excuse Mauricio Verdum. This is a man who has consistently produced and proven... Fast that hands. Given Saturday night, this Tremendous strength. Oh, come on, guys. Junior Dos Santos combines aggression, accuracy, one-punch knockout power with incredible takedown defense, focus, drive, and determination. He is one of the elite heavyweights on the planet Earth. It's one of those guys who would have fought Brock Lesnar back in 2011, but diverticulitis sucks. We all know that. So here's the Black Beast, Derek Lewis. He gets the better of the striking in the Black most of his Beast. UFC encounters. Takedown defense is on point. He's an underrated grappler as well, Joe. Born in New Orleans, Louisiana, but the Black Beast claims Houston, Texas. Houston certainly claims the Black Beast. They believe they've got an eventual UFC champion on their hands. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. All right, for one, I'm excited for this fight. For Saturday night, that's for sure. But for now, we're going to be having this fight happening here in the virtual world. That is EA UFC 3. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Dos Santos is two years the elder. Lewis weighed in at 260 pounds. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Hmm, interesting. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. Now. This is the moment UFC has around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. It's time. <laughs> 
I think it is going to be five rounds. Get to it then. All right, grip the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come out your corners, come out fight. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. All right, and let's get to, to it. Go live action from Toyota Center here in Houston, Texas. All right, so here he is, mm. the former UFC heavyweight champion. All right, come on, Derek. You got this, man. Not the show. Oh, boy. No, boy. No, that ain't gonna happen. Not, not right now. Not today. This could be oh, it. he might be out. This is crazy. Oh, my goodness. Vicious combo there. Come on. Damn it. Big overhands. Stamina's... No, keep, keep your... Come on. Keep your endurance up. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues... Keep that endurance, Black Beast. By almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Gotta find a way to move those two and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Oh, come on. Oh, you got this, Derek. No disrespect to Dos Santos, but man, I'm, I'm gonna be siding with... Ah. Oh. The left hook over the top. The left hook hits home. Throwing that jab now again. Mm. The fighter evades. Oh, and he lands another jab, using the jab beautifully all night. Punches in bunches. Timing Come on. perfect. You better play better defense than that. That one hurt. <sighs> and just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. And he lands That's another right. Hit. Well, that'll work. Counter jab to the head by Dos Santos. There we go. Come on. Good job to get the foot off the canvas and two Good footwork. Beautiful inside leg kick by the black. Knowing Derek Lowe's, I know he's gonna go for those big oh there we go. Those big big shots, those big right shots from Derek Lewis. Wow, big overhand right miss. I mean I don't see Dos Santos winning this fight this Saturday. I just go oh boy, here we go. He's in a lot of trouble. Come on. Big body shot. Here we go. Oh boy. Here we go. Keep your keep your distance. Stay away from him. Oh boy. Oh no 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 no. What? Gotta be kidding me, man. Jeez. May not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his Oh, come on, man. Right <sighs> no, nah, it ain't gonna happen this Saturday. It ain't gonna happen, man. Let's take a look at that again. <sighs> Unless Junior Dos Santos might come up with a and here it is again. With a win. <sighs> Might be big upset. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout. All right, the official decision is inside the octagon. That's where we find Bruce Buff. Come on, man. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliotti has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 52 seconds. I, go mo I see more of this fight going maybe to a decision. It might go under a decision. Worst case scenario. 
Worst case scenario, you hear you hear the you hear it first. Junior Dos Santos adds to it here tonight. There he is, the affable former champion, enjoying this win with his coaches and his teammates. Yeah, Jay yeah. Celebrate while you can, Dos Santos. <laughs> Although I do love your last name. <laughs> Alright, let's quit. Yeah, Dos Santos got this one. Alright. You know, I've always been curious. I want to know the the list for the for the music in this one. Let's see. Um. Yeah, you got ASAP Rocky. Sorry, my phone's ringing right now. Big Boy, Dave East, DJ Cali, Future, Spin, Hobson. Sorry. Meek Mill, what's he doing here? Rap City, really? Rick Ross, Shredders, Tech Nine, The Killers. Hmm. Interesting. Pretty sure the RKG man will like this uh, set list of music. Huge playlist that is. All right. So why don't we do this? Since we got some time, why don't we do a um, simulation of this one? Let me see if I can find anybody else out there other than the welterweight division. Because I do know that there's a welterweight uh, bout uh, for UFC Fight Night. So let's check it out. I do know that Ka uh, Curtis... Uh, Mill Millinder is fighting, so let me see if I can find him, if he's here or not. So this is under the welterweight division. See Bruce Lee here. <laughs> yeah, I can't find him. I don't think he's here. Wait, Matt Sarah's here? <laughs> I didn't even know about that. Yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, George St. Pierre. It sucks that the guy, he had to retire, but, you know, this happens. Matt Brown. Yeah, they don't have him. So, why don't we do this? Let's see. I'm gonna try to do something crazy. I wonder if he's here or not under this division. Yeah, it's probably the only fight I'm going to be doing as far as, um, as far as for UFC Fight Night. Max Holloway, nah. Come on. Chael Sonnen. wonder if he's here. Oh, Robbie Lawler. <laughs> that was one hell of a performance that Ben Askren had with Robbie Lawler in the last UFC event. UFC 235. Hmm. Come on. I see I can find him. Oh, here he is. Okay. Oh, no, wait. Come on. I'm gonna do something crazy. Okay. I'm 
gonna throw in CM Punk versus um <laughs> wonder if I can find him yeah because he's gotta fight somebody who is crazy let's do it yeah let's do it <laughs> yeah Yeah, why not? The most famous arena, Madison Square Garden. Bruce Lee versus CM Punk. <laughs> Something that nobody's ever dreamed of. And all right, let's let's see what let's see what CM Punk's got in this one. Let's see if he can take on the father of martial arts. All right, coming up next, a welterweight matchup between CM Punk and Bruce Lee. Jeez, man, that's just. That's just crazy. <laughs> oh man. He is the founder of Jeet Kune Do and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Yeah, about that. <laughs> That's right. Bruce Lee taking on. CM Punk. WWE superstar, now UFC fighter, CM Punk. UFC debut, of course, at UFC 203 in 2016 against Mickey Gall. That did not go his way. That said, you would be wise not to count out a man with this type of work ethic. You talk to Duke Rufus and the other guys at Rufus Board in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. This is zero fights in his career. <laughs> We'll Lost two fights in group. What the hell, dude? This guy is an excellent grappler. What he wants to do here is get a hold of his opponent and bring the fight to his world. Either press him up against the cage, rough him up with dirty boxing, or drag him to the ground, control him, and possibly submit him. Or tail of the day. Yeah. Good luck with that. Unless you can pull up a good upset victory with me, CM Punk. With some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, let's get to the fight. Are you ready? You ready? Damn right, come on. Underway at the Mecca, Madison Square Garden in New York City. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go through round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent. Oh, man. This isn't going to go well. <laughs> Oh man, this isn't gonna go well. Oh boy. Jeez. CM Punk is a lot taller than Bruce Lee. Oh man, no, 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 there's no way in hell Bruce Lee's gonna lose to CM Punk. Hell no, man. Hard straight punch. Spinning backfist. Come on, Bruce Lee. You got this, man. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. That ain't gonna happen. That ain't gonna happen. Oh, come on, man. Full guard. Oh, man, that cut looks terrible. He's bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped the fight with that kind of stuff. Ain't gonna happen, man. It ain't gonna happen. Just misses with the straight right. Oh. CM Punk gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. These guys are swinging. How about that chin? Come on, Bruce Lee. Kick his ass. There you go. Oh, yeah. Come on. He's inside control here. Tags him with the left. He's stuck in half guard here, but he's landing some nasty combinations. Come on, half guard, half guard. No, 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 no. He's looking for the triangle choke here. 
What he wants to do is he wants to pin no, 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 no. hands to his chest, then throw the leg over the shoulder. No, 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 no. Come on, man. No, no, no. He's going to pull down on his leg and then throw his other leg over that ankle. You got to be kidding me, man. What? Round was almost over, but he sunk in the submission and got the victory. Come on, man, that's yeah, not real. That is not real. That is not what's gonna. <laughs> okay, yeah, I need. I need some work with the uh, trying to break out of that submission hold. <sighs> and one more time, beautiful technique here on this triangle. For the victory. I need to get out of the submission holds, man, because here in, in the UFC, UFC 3, time, it's a lot more nice difficult than I thought. I'm, I'm still trying submission. to learn. I mean, probably I can break out of that from if I'm like ever caught in it. I can probably do that, but in the game, man, no, nah, hell no. Huge victory in his career. I mean, I'll try to do my best to try to break out of it in real life, but here, uh, it's gonna. No. It's going to take its time. It's not real, dude. It's not real. It can't happen. Can't even imagine CM Punk beating Bruce Lee if Bruce Lee was still alive. That's just not going to happen. All right, so I just wanted to make this stream short as possible. Wanted to uh, do a little bit of that for UFC Fight Night that's coming up in the um, at the on Saturday. So check that out: Giro dos Santos versus Derek the Black Beast Lewis. And be sure to be on the lookout for you um, for the Ring Generals. I know me and Nick we're going to be diving into what happened with UFC 235 since we watched it together. We we're going to dive into that. We're going to dive into the predictions. Well, we're going to be seeing who's going to win, who's going to lose between Luis and Dos Santos. And we're going to be talking about uh, the up-and-coming pay-per-view for WWE's Fastlane and the uh, announcement for Canelo's future fight that's coming up in May. And, man, we're going to be talking about Raw and SmackDown. A whole bunch of good stuff coming up. And as we get closer to WrestleMania, we're going to be throwing in more good stuff for you. So be sure to be on the lookout. Hit the subscribe button. Like us on Facebook, uh, Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. Check us out. And be sure to look out for another episode of The Ring Generals on YouTube and SoundCloud. Uh, yeah, be sure to uh, check that out. And hey, give us uh, your comment, feedback like dislike if you have to <laughs> so this has been the ring generals and this is eric santos streaming ufc 3 hope to see you in the next stream and raise a glass in the sky and salute the ring generals